Hey, what's up, my cool like that peeps? It is me, your cool like that Asian in the house. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And right now, we are actually in the mountains again. And if you guys can see the mountains right, right now, it's really beautiful out here. Someone's house is up there also. Yeah. It's really beautiful out here. But can you hear the music? Yes, what kind oh, of... Did you hear that? What kind of music is it? Um, Indian music. I don't know. Oh. Yes, uh, we're at the Manitou Cliff Dwellings here in Colorado Springs. And they, uh, these are actual dwellings that were built back in 80, somewhere in 80. <laughs> million, not million. I can't remember. I can't remember, but if you pan the camera this way, we wanted to just kind of show you of how it looks like back then. Manitou Cliff Dwellings. They have pictures of these in there from the 1900s. Yep, it's really nice and everything. I would I would have showed you guys the museum, but I can't do that anymore because <laughs> of partnership reasons. I can't do that. So, but we want, we can't show you What reasons? Partnership reasons. What's up with the partnership? I got partnered with YouTube, so. Ah. Oh, so congratulations. Any, thank you. If anybody can do me a ba banner or something for my page, that would be great. I'm trying to look for somebody who can do that or find someone who can do it. So, yeah. Cool, like that Asian page banner? Yeah. Right. Let's take Come on, let's go take a look on the inside. Don't be looking at my biscuits. I'm not showing everybody your biscuits. Look at this. Supervised from the course. Brittany. Brittany's in the car. Oh, yeah. She's cold. What is it? The bird. So you can't see it right you now. You can't see it. There's some flurries, but um, this is a structure for a four-family, um, four-family uh, four-room home. So kind of cool. I'll take you through here a little bit. It's kind of cool. She doesn't want to come in here. She's, uh, her back is hurting. Oh. That's what you get for being pregnant, huh? <laughs> I think I showed them backwards. They have numbers. Oh, cool. Look. Okay, let's go find Jason. Where are you? Hello? Oh, okay. There he is. This is... What is that? So other people talking. It's kind of interesting. How they lived and everything. It was a simple life back then. You said it was a simple life? It looked like it. A simple life. <laughs> storage bin. This is a storage bin. Storage bin. I don't know if you guys can see that. So when a person died, burials were usually made outside the cave when the weather was warm. During the winter when the ground was frozen, outside the, of the cave, burials were made in the trash piles, which were easy to dig in. Oh. Okay. You hear the birds? Yeah. We are not you gonna walk through? We are not seeing here.
That's where we just came from. This is, right here is the ceremonial chamber. It's a what? It's a ceremonial chamber. Or some to roof made of crib logs. Yeah. Oh. Interesting. It's a little chamber. Oh, this air is so thin. Oh my god. It's the birds. See, I told you birds are craziness. It's the fireplace. At least they had sense enough to have uh sense enough to have uh ventilation way back then. This is interesting. There's the mountains. The mountains. Pike Peak is covered in snow right now, you can't see it. I mean, uh, covered with clouds right now, you can't see it. Okay, back to the tour. So this side is, this side is a two-story, two-family home. Um, yeah. yeah. I don't know how they... I wonder whose room this was. <laughs> this is a um, chief speaker structure. That's where we started. I don't know if we can fit it. That's where we are. Which way did you go? Right here. This, know, my, this place ain't built for a fat body. <laughs> This is a three-family um, structure home. It looks like a tower. Go ahead, the tower. It's almost like a tower out here. Um, then uh, uh, it's going even before the cliff dwellings were built in caves. The Indians were farming. Uh, were a farming society, and living on the mesa tops and in the valleys, but due to ever-increasing raids by warlike nomadic Indians, the peaceful farming people began to abandon their mesa top homes for the safety of constructing homes in the caves. Cool. It's kind of cool, huh? I'm trying to look through here. It's in here. I wonder whose room that was. Somebody was punished. There's Jason's buddy. The bird that keeps flying around. Uh -huh. This is the balcony structure. So this stone was two stories, four family um, structure built in the latter part of the Great Pueblo period and one of the most perfectly reserved of all homes in the Southwest. And all that stuff. Oh, it's being You're gonna climb the ladder? Climb the ladder. Oh. Jason is climbing the ladder. Can I go up there? Yeah, go ahead. I'll take a picture. You wanna talk? Alright, people. 
look at this beauty. beauty. This is Colorado, and the Cliff Dwelling uh, Museum is down there. Uh, so you guys, if you guys ever come to Colorado, this is one of the um, sites that you might want to see while you're here. Um, so it's going to snow tonight, and it's going to be great. <laughs> Anyways, we will catch you guys all later. Love ya. Bye. Bye, hot camera guy. Bye, cool like that Asian. <laughs>